the public sector has a big responsibility, and that requires using the right technology. Join us in historic downtown Austin, Texas, as we talk to SoftServe about how the public sector has been adopting the cloud with Google Cloud Partners. Thanks for joining us today, Ron. Can you tell us a little bit more about SoftServe? Sure, absolutely. SoftServe is a curious company. Uh, starting about 26 years ago, founded by uh, some rocket scientists and their PhD students, set out to solve problems in the data world, uh, complex software issues, and systems that just didn't want to talk and didn't want to play together. Uh, the company is now pushing 10,000 people, uh, spread around close to 30 delivery centers across the globe. So SoftServe is a Google Cloud partner. What does that mean for companies who choose to work with SoftServe? Sure, well, it means a few things. It means that we have best of breed technologies to work with. It means that we've got several hundred certified people on Google Cloud. It means that we work hand in glove with GCP to be certain that our clients are getting the best in, of both worlds, not just technology for technology's sake, but technology for the people's sake and making sure that those pieces of technology are delivered in concert with the end goal and that end goal is determined in concert. How does this look for the public sector? Well, the public sector is its own animal, as we all know, right? Uh, they have a very big responsibility, uh, and the responsibility is to the lives of the people, their constituents, right? What happens on the roadways, what happens in the buildings, what happens in the communities? And when they look into, into technology solutions, they tend to be limited because of that lens. So bringing in somebody like an outside partner, like a soft serve, to work with technologies that these municipalities know they need or the public sector in general knows they need or suspects they may need sometimes. It puts them in a, in a position of really being able to stay focused on what their mission is while outsourcing to us to be able to come in and give them really expert advice. That's a really great way to put it. And one of those examples for technologies is the cloud. Sure. What does that look like for SoftServe to partner with these public sector entities and then look at implementing things in the cloud? Sure. So there is the initial reticence, the challenges that go with what, it's not mine, it's not in my four walls, uh, I don't have a team of people to manage it. But shortly behind that comes the realization that you really don't have control over this. There are employees who are using their own devices that are accessing personal accounts that are doing their shopping and whatever else. And so you do have outside influence on your own network. But then you get into the costs of supporting these massive server farms that you'd need to support connected and autonomous vehicles, connected uh, devices to the environment. There's the scale that you need to be able to operate with and, and at. And so when you start considering these things and you think about your public sector responsibility to be frugal while being responsible, uh, it makes a lot of sense to move to the cloud and, and really look into how you can do that. One of the things we really like to do is focus in on assessments and making sure that those assessments result in a plan. And Google Cloud is very much in sync with that. Well, thanks so much for coming in, Ron, and telling us about how SoftServe helps enable companies, including the public sector, to really understand and do more with their data. Sure, I appreciate the opportunity. Thank you. Thanks for watching. And stay tuned as we talk more about the technology behind building a smart city with SoftServe.